Hey there friends, welcome back to the channel, Creating with Sarah. Today's video I have a plan with me and my Erin Condren. It's my catch-all, it's what I use for daily planning and we're gonna plan out with using Happy Planner stickers. I have Pastel Tropics and then this little organizer. So if you guys wanna check out this plan with me, then keep on watching. So hey there friends, welcome back to the channel. I'm Sarah, all things creating, planning, yet keeping things fun and functional here on my YouTube channel. I love sharing uh, planner tips and uh, plans with me, hauls, sometimes a review for other small planner companies, just a lot of fun things. So I hope you'll stick around. So it is summertime. Oh my gosh, I've been so busy. I know I haven't posted in quite some time, but since school got out, I'm kind of shocked. I didn't think I'd be so busy, but since the kids have, you know, been back to school and making friends and things like that, um, this summer, which they didn't get last summer, um, they're spending more time with their friends that they made. So I've been like the taxi driver and um, trying to keep up with daily houses and appointments. So it's just been really busy. So today we're gonna try to pre-plan um, the majority of my week instead of doing two days at a time, which normally I do. If you've been following my uh, channel or my plans with me, so I have the Erin Condren Daily Petite. And I'm gonna share a flip through or a current state before I try to switch over for July because I do have new planners that I kind of want to play with in July um, because I've been so overwhelmed and busy. I'm just like, blah and I'm, hopefully it'll get me back into being excited about using them because right now I'm just like overwhelmed with all the things. So I have this daily planner and I usually normally plan you know two days at a time or the weekend which it gives you three days at a glance in the daily petite planner. So it's Friday and then you get a small section for Saturday and Sunday which for me it's okay at the moment like um, I don't need a whole lot of space and I feel like I can focus better on just planning that day than having like a week at a glance. Um, this year I just wanted to try it so it's been working well. Um, so I can't wait to start the new planners, which one of them is a weekly out of view. It's the new Erin Condren Compact Vertical and then the other one is the daily, um, it's kind of like a daily but it's in an hourly form but you do have a side for um, a to-do list and then you, I think you have like a a blank space at the bottom. So I hope that I have time to set those up for you all so you can see how I'm using those in my lineup for the summer. And then um, I do have one last haul to share with you. I have my Christian Design stickers that came in, a Shine Sticker Studio. Um, I have a Simply Gilded Summer Box, which I'm really excited about. And um, I did make a trip to Daiso um, just recently and they had a lot of new stickers out. I try not to go in that store because it really, because the stickers are like a dollar, it just, I tend to just add way too much to my little cart. But anywho, I will share more of a current flip through of this later, but let's go ahead and get to this plan with me. So it's not extremely long, but I do want to uh, plan out a full week and not just, you know, two days at a time. All right, so I have my little bookmark here. This bookmark, it works really well actually for this type of planner. Um, I think it was in like a Walmart little planner kit that my daughter had like a long time ago. So we're gonna try to plan out in this video really quickly my whole week. So the 13th through the 19th which is Father's Day. I just thought about that. But I really wanted to use, <laughs> since I refreshed my sticker stash, you guys will see that video up. Um, I wanted to use Pastel Tropics. So maybe I will have to pull this one and off the top of my head, um, wait, I did pull some new washi. So. Let me just grab this one right here. You guys will get a sneak peek. I think that video will be up before this one though. I have two washi here that are kind of like dad-like. I think our plans is trying to go fishing. Um, really haven't done that since we moved here. 
Um, so we're going to try to do that. We'll see how that goes. Um, so I have that. I'll just leave this to the side of me, but I love that thing and I don't have to like go and look for washi because I have so much of it, but I have this one here. It's kind of like a woody or wildlife type of um, washi. I got this in her box. She used to do like monthly subscription boxes and I know she's changed her whole thing. So if you don't know about Simply Gilded, you'll definitely have to go to her Instagram and check out her lives. And it's just got like a cute, like wildlife. It definitely gives me like fishing vibes, outdoorsy. So maybe I could try to implement this. And it came with this one here, which is more of like a glitter textured washi. I don't know how I feel about this type of washi. I don't use it too much, but it's sticky, but it just has like a really thick glittered texture. So I have that. I mean, I do have other washi next to me. Um, and then I am thinking about grabbing another sticker book over there on my shelf. It's a mega sticker book. So let me just grab that real quick. Okay, so this was the mega sticker book that I was thinking about. I thought that the stick figures in the back of this book, if you have it, um, it has like these little cute doodle stick friends. It has a skateboard and a bike and a kite. It's kind of like for spring. It's kind of like a seasonal one. Well, it is called seasonal all in a season. And this is what I was thinking, but I thought it had more fish fishing stickers, but it's more of like vacation mode. Um, there's some palm trees. It has like some foiling to it. So that may not work. And then I also have summer fun and cheerful seasons. This one has some nice summer beachy things. Again, I'm just trying to think of what I could add for Father's Day. I don't know off the top of my head if I have anything that has fishing like now that I think about it I know this sticker book came with like a tiny sticker pad or not tiny it's called petite so I have this one I don't think this has any fishing I think it's just summer barbecue themed but I think this one came with you know one of those I never grabbed it I should have. I think it was a lot of icon stickers, which I really like these. I'm not, I don't think Happy Planner comes out with these anymore. I think they stopped making these, but I personally like this because I love cute deco icons. I think they're perfect for when you're not someone who uses a lot of stickers for decorating. So, all right, we'll just see what we can do. I have this one here. This has a lot of stickers that were from the dashboard packs. They don't do those either anymore. Um, they've changed a whole lot in the past, what, year? Um, I, I feel like after 2020, they've changed. Um, yeah, this thing can be a little annoying, but I do have some icons in here, and I just thought I would use this because I think it has a lot of cute animals yeah here in the back and these are more paper um oh my gosh you could do a cute doggy theme if your husband loves pets or maybe a cat if he's a cat lover we have two cats okay so i have that first thing i'm going to do is my weather is the first thing i'm going to do so let me pull this back out and grab my Nicole stickers here for the weather. Cloud, sunny, and then partly cloudy. And I'll just leave that also here to the side of me because I do have extra stickers in there. I'm gonna go ahead and write in the weather. Added my weather through the whole week here, and now I'm just taking my white out and whiting out these lines up at the top so I can add either washi or a sticker border. Okay. 
So I think we'll just save these for the weekend and figure that out. And then this sticker book has, um, is what I like to call, you know, border stickers or washi paper stickers. And those I can use up at the top. Um, I also have these quotes I can mix in if, you know, the washi is not long enough. Where'd I go? These right here, just depending on what they say. And I also can use these here. So I've used the sticker quite a bit. So we'll start here. And go ahead and use this one. It's pretty long, so I don't have to worry about... Ah! Ah, oh, that worries me, but I did pick up some of the white out. So I tried to edit out this, like my kids in the background. So yes, we're out of school. You may hear them in the background. Um, my office is like an open space, so there's not like a door or anything. So it just picks up so much sound. And you sometimes can hear them, but I tried to edit it out. It's so weird how it picks up sound like that. just picked up more white out. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you'll stick around and hit the subscribe button. I do use a lot of Happy Planner stickers um, only because I have a huge collection. I really need to use them up because I did switch, of course, to using an Erin Condren and I don't use a whole lot of um, kits per se. I have used them, but I do like using the Happy Planner sticker books. They're really cute and it does take a little bit <laughs> to flip through them and figure out what you want to use as far as like decorating and functional, but um, yeah, so I just kind of use a little bit of everything. So that's cool. We got that one down. I wonder if we can do the same for uh, Wednesday and Thursday and use the purple one. It just, I don't, it's still a little bit shorter, so maybe I can add one of those quotes in or something. Um, so when I do my current flip through, I'll share what I mean. I did use uh, Planner Kate. I've used, I've ordered a, quite a bit from her sticker kits. Okay, someone says hello the weekend. Oh, I just have a plain one here. Today has been canceled. Best weekend. Uh, just keep going girl T totally loving life be excited about everything best weekend um, so yeah you probably just heard my daughter just laugh there <laughs> um, totally loving life maybe that's appropriate because kids are loving life right now <laughs> at least I hope the majority of them are having a good summer Let's just see how this will work. My idea here. Maybe I don't have to. I can just start on this page. And then just add the rest of that sticker here. Oh, that's super cute. Okay, I'm just going to cut this. that gap so I'm just gonna cut this sticker here it's a little bit too big um, it's just what I kind of focus on if you have the EC Petite um, for decorating I kind of focus on that covering the block sometimes um, you can decorate right here and then add your box header you can definitely, you know, um, the sides and definitely this piece down here is like a great spot to add more decorative stickers if you if you tend to use this space more for, you know, your plans. Probably crooked, but it's just because the way I am planning, I can't really see it overhead. 
Okay. So let's go to the weekend and go ahead and add our washi. Um, just fix this real quick. So maybe I won't use the glitter one. I'll just use this one here. I believe this one is a little bit bigger. Oh, see, I just pulled all that off. That's okay. And I want to get closest to the top of the paper as I can. I did go ahead and add the glitter washi. It actually looks really cool once it's swatched out. I do have a gap there. Oh, you know what? Just leave it. Um, maybe I can straighten it with my X-Acto knife. There we go. It was just kind of bugging me like that. Okay. Yeah, it looks pretty cool swatched out. Alright, so let's go back to... The only thing is, is that I tried to get it as close as the top as I could. I don't like that it covers the numbers, but it's all right. All right, let's go back to Monday and figure out how to cover up these blocks or if I want to just keep them as is and just write in a title. So I'm just gonna flip through here first and see what I have to work with. So I do have these smaller flags here. Um, it's just depending on what they say. The plan, meeting, best day. Um, you got this. Of course I have these boxes here. I have these clear stickers. I wonder how big these look like over this. I could do that. I'll put today here for the kids to see if they have anything planned. I think for Monday where it's going to be like a chill day though. And I'll put this to do here for work stuff. So, um, and I'll go ahead and do that for on the other side but I'll swap it and put today. I mean, I do have an appointment one, which is early in the morning too. Maybe I'll just do that. I'll put today here. I'll just put appointment here. And I'll put to do at the bottom. Oh, let me use a different one. Okay, perfect. On this one, so, Wednesday and Thursday, I'm going to use Happy Plans, but because they're stacked, I'm going to cut them in half and see if they'll fit better here for the kids section. whatever plans that they have made. I think these two days is gonna be a little bit hotter so they can go to the pool. Um, I think there's like a movie deal on Tuesdays in our area. Uh, maybe we can go to the mall. Just I just know that these two days are free for doing something. Um, plus I have to make plans to get Father's Day stuff. So one of these two days I have to do that as well. So then I'll put priority here and priority on the other side. And then I'll put to do at the bottom again. And I only have one more left to do. And then 
for Father's Day, we'll have to switch it up because those colors do not work. Um, let me go back to here. And for appointments, I'm just going to grab a box. Wow, that's a pretty big box. It takes up that whole space. What am I thinking? I'll just use this circle one. It does say appointment around it. So I'll use that and just write an arrow. Um, I do have a sticker. Is it in here? Yeah, I think it's in here actually. These stickers in the back. I'm trying to use these up. Because that's like my number one thing this morning on this day is I gotta get this appointment and get ready for it. There we go. I'm trying to use those up, so that was perfect. All right. Um, you know what, I wanna use these up. I really should, I'm just gonna like try to use up a lot of my stickers so these checklists I'm going to put here, I think they're really cute looking. The color combination, I'm just I'm going to have to cut some of these down. Oh shoot, didn't really cut that straight. There we go. And I'm going to do that for the other side. We're going to go with blue. And pink and I'm still gonna do like healthy habits are just gonna be a little bit different um, since the kids got out of school I really haven't had a lot of time to work out um, I have made time to work out with them though but it's just been like you know when you make your own schedule with working out and the kids are in school, you have the time to have your lunch at a certain time, you have the time to um, relax or stretch or you know take your shower. And with the kids being home and everything, it kind of gets shuffled around. So I'm just like not bothering with it unless um, I go to the gym with them and have that time to do that. Because their, their schedule is a little bit more free than mine because they don't have to go to the grocery store or make dinner and things like that afterwards. So um, I'm just not gonna be like, I'm gonna give myself grace. I'm not gonna be like feeling bad if I don't get to go to the gym or whatever. At least though, I can shoot for a goal. At, I used to you know, work out four to five times a week and now it's kind of down to two to three, so. If I can at least get two to three, that would be great. And that still seems crooked. I will fix that later. Do I have enough for the next day? Okay, I'm gonna do that. So I can mess with this off camera. I'm gonna add checklist to these two days. Okay, I've added the checklist Monday through Thursday. And so the weekend we're gonna do little something different because it's a whole different color palette. So what I was thinking is I'm gonna take some of this washi here. This is a grid washi from the Erin um, Condren launch. I did share this and did a swatch and review on this. Um, so this one's like a dark blue and this one's got like um, kind of orangey red, like more of an antique color. However, I think I like this one more. So that means I need to white out these boxes. Blue um, blocks could work. You have like a blue tint of shade throughout the washi there. But I'm gonna go ahead and just white out this. Okay, now I can add the washi down. Okay, there, perfect. So that's done. Just need some headers to put down, and I think I will. Let me see if there's anything in here first. This cute sticker that says Father's Day, I can put it right there. Father's Day is on the 19th on Sunday. 
I have a lot of numbers and letters and just boxes. I have like, I think my other one has more of like, oh, something like this. Oh, perfect. I could use this one. Let's see how these work. I'll just write on those. Or should I use gold? that'll work cool so I'll just write in there what I need and I'm definitely gonna leave a space for a photo for this weekend so I have that down all right so I can remove well I don't want to remove this appointment I'll just put it in my June monthly okay so now let's find some boxes for down here for the um, extra pages. I may just leave the weekend like this just because I don't want to put too much down and not know what our plans are. Um, let's see, for working out Monday, probably not. Tuesday, have an appointment. I just want to see maybe some walking. Maybe I can shoot for some steps. So I'm going to add... These cute little, they're just cute little quote decorative sticker boxes. I'm gonna put this one for just hang in there since it's more of like, because you know, coming back from Sunday and catching up on things, I still have to do like daily house stuff. So um, I'm gonna layer like some boxes down here and make a little cluster, but yeah, I, I need to catch up on those things. So I have to go to the grocery store, prep for trash day on Tuesday, you know, meal plan, all that same stuff. Just because it's summer doesn't mean that I stop doing that. I just do the same here, but sometimes what Happy Planner does, um, it's like you get a sheet of stickers without foil and then stickers with foil. So I guess I should just do that, or maybe I should swap these. Hope that it'd be the same color. But you guys, I don't know if you guys can see it, but you see how like this today box is with silver foiling because I don't think I have another one that's not, and I prefer without foiling. Yeah, I don't see anything. So, yeah, oh yeah, I can't swap because it'll be the same color. And these boxes have this indention and that's why I'm trying to utilize this box and place it behind it because it's mainly for like a classic size happy planner for like your monthly view and it, peak it has that peekaboo spot for your date. I think what I want to do is add an animal. Just really quickly. Let's add a cute, let's add a cute little panda and koala. There's my panda. Oh my gosh, I should definitely use these stickers more. They're really hard to get out of the book. I've had them for a couple of years now. Okay. So I kind of want to do that here. Let's switch it up. And I have these two boxes. Maybe we can put this one down here. 
Again, if you see me place these down and they're not straight, I apologize. It's just at this angle and I don't have like this closest to me so I can see it. Okay. Um, I think this one actually has also animals in here and some quotes. Maybe we can add a quote. <gasps> Look at these birds. Oh my gosh, so cute. Add this cheetah here and I wonder if this bird's gonna fit oh yeah he'll fit okay and oh I have like sloths and the little lizards I just love that they're all like different colors that's really cute you could also do a, like a little border of the sloths you know hanging up here um, and then I need a like a smaller box. So maybe I'll utilize these for verse of the day. Sometimes in these boxes, if I don't get to my workout or whatever, I just put steps or that I stretched or that I rest or that I took a nap. Because I am having some issues. The reason, another reason is like I've been having weird back issues. So I'm having to go to the doctor and see what that's all about. So that way I can just make sure that I'm not overdoing it when I go to work out. Just want to have the okay to continue working out. Fix this. Dang, I think sometimes I need like a leveler. Like, you know, when you use that to hang up pictures, like... Good lord. I need like the smallest ruler sticker leveler or something to place stickers down. Okay, so we got that done, got that done. Again, I know I'm not putting pens down, but like I have my plans to the side of me and I'm just gonna write that later. But um, I do use my planner. This is kind of like a foundation for me to go ahead and write in all my plans. And I've gotten used to how to utilize the petite planner and where I want to put my plans. So hopefully that gives you guys an idea that this is kind of like a foundation to putting my stickers down. So I have planned out or pretty much put down a foundation for my plans using stickers. Um, so pretty much I use the Pastel Tropics for Monday through Thursday. And then we kind of used washi and some stickers from this book. I will probably add more stickers to this. Um, again, I'll probably share like um, a current flip through of this entire planner and how it went and everything. Um, so that way you get more after the pen. But um, yeah, I'm gonna leave it like this because I just don't know yet. I wanna, I don't wanna put too much down and I know I'm gonna leave some room for photos and things. So we'll see. Um, but I pretty much got these two pages done and they look cute. So I did add stickers up here just because this white space was bugging me. So I used these cute little note to self, you know, usually I use this for like, um, a packing list, a to buy list, um, errands that I need to get done, just whatever needs to, to get done that day. And so on this side, I put remember and I added a clear, uh, leopard sticker in the back for just a little border and I did that to both um, pages so I thought that was really cute that way I can use up more of these stickers and then I added these circle stickers at the bottom to write my verses because I forgot about that because um, I added a lot of this decorative down here and yeah so I pretty much used these blocks to split out my day with you know mom stuff my kids if they have plans and then this is for me if I want to do any extra work stuff or whatever, if I don't, I just put a little note there. Um, yeah, or I could use some of this stuff for summer ideas for the next day or something like that at the bottom if I wanted to do that instead of doing content work. That's kind of what I use the bottom for, just depending on my schedule. I'm gonna to try to um, push out some more videos as much as I can. You do have a shot my stash that should be out or it's a refresh for the summer. Um, and then I'll have a haul up um, 
for some of the last couple of things that I have purchased and I'm definitely going on a no buy. Um, but I hope you guys are enjoying your summer and you have a wonderful Father's Day weekend and I will see you all in the next one. Take care, stay safe and happy planning. Bye.